Hi y'all, I'm Ta. Hi guys, I'm Da. I'm from the north and I'm from the south. And today we are going to show you how to make stuffed pork chops with potatoes and carrots, gravy and onions. Looks good, doesn't it? We'll be back. Da, I want you to show me how to make those stuffed pork chops. They were so good. Okay, but if I make some, you have to eat it. Okie dokie. <laughs> Okay, um, this is how we're going to start. I, I would like Ta to make the dressing for me while I'm starting the other. We have everything measured out and she'll tell you what she's going to do okay. and then I'll do the pork chops. Okay. I have one and a half cups of water and a fourth of a cup of margarine that I'm going to boil on the step. Okay, while she's doing that, I got these delicious looking pork chops. And they're so big that I decided I'm going to stuff them. So I'm going to cut each one in half, not all the way through. And when Ta gets the dressing done, that's what will go in here. So I'm going to cut these first. I'm going to season them. And by that time, the dressing should be almost done. Okay, I'm going to cut these pork chops almost in half, not quite. I'm going to season them. I'm going to season them with garlic powder and salt and pepper. And we don't need to do really too much more because there's a lot of seasoning in the dressing. And to make it really easy, we're using a ready-made dressing. First, I'm putting the garlic powder on. Now I'm going to put the salt and pepper Let me help you. That's harder than it looks. Yes. I don't know why our I don't know why our producer didn't look that's just regular. <laughs> I usually just use regular salt yeah. pepper. Do you want to do this one too or you want sure, me to try? I'll do it. Okay. Okay. So the dressing's not ready yet, but I'm going to go over here and I'm going to get this pan ready. Okay, I'm over here and I'm going to get this pan ready. This pan is going to hold the pork chops and we're going to bake them separate just because I want these to look very pretty. And this is going to have gravy in it and I don't want the gravy to get mixed up with everything. I, I took the skin off a couple, couple big onions. I'm just going to put it in the bottom of this pan because I love cooked onions. So good. They are good. Especially with chops and steak and beef. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be leaving out uh -huh. chicken. Yeah, we can probably do it with chicken too. And I think my, my water and my margarine is boiling. Okay. I'm going to turn it down. Okay, so I'm going to add two cups of stuffing mix. And while she does this, I'm going to make the gravy. The gravy is so simple. It's a can of mushroom soup. Or you could put a can of um, celery soup. If you're making something with chicken, you can put a, a can of, of chicken soup in here. Not with the noodles, just the, just the soup. And I'm going to put some milk in here. This is going to be kind of like a roast because it's, it's so good. And everything cooks at once and you know we like easy cheesy recipes. I'm going to put all these carrots in here because they're so cooked when they're good when they're cooked in the oven. This is eight potatoes. I've cleaned them and cut them. And I'm going to put this in here too. You know, I'm from the north and, and we don't do rice. We do mostly, mostly potatoes and I love potatoes. But I, I use a lot of potatoes because I like it. Uh, Todd, would you give me the salt and pepper please? Sure. 
couple of bagels things to eat right here. Right. Okay. I'll put the these in there. So oh, for you. The garlic salt. The garlic. The garlic powder. The garlic powder. And the dressing is done, so I just put it on the other burner to oh, keep cool. it. I'm going to put the salt and pepper in here. A little bit of garlic salt because garlic powder. garlic powder because as you know you can never have enough garlic powder especially at Halloween time <laughs> especially when we cook <laughs> <laughs> okay I'm gonna put the top on this and then I'm gonna do the pork chops and we're gonna put them both in the oven at the same time okay, okay. now you want to bring the dressing over for me Perfect. Okay, now I'm gonna now I'm gonna do stuffed pork chops. Okay, dressing done. Mm -hmm. Okay. I am gonna fill these pork chops with dressing. I've never made stuffed pork. Chops. You see them in the store when they're already made up in the case. Yeah. And you pay like two dollars more for the, for being stuffed. Yeah. Well, that's what they do right there. Yeah. Isn't that hard? <laughs> Please give me two dollars extra for doing this. Okay, I know we set some toothpicks out. Okay. Where we put them? rest of this dressing in with the pork chops and let it cook a little more in the oven. And when it comes out, I'm going to plate it up for you and you'll have a wonderful meal. Now I'm going to put the top on this. Make sure you get the aluminum all sealed in there so it can have all the, the steam to cook it. All the seasonings and herbs Because, and because the pork chops are pretty thick so it's going to take a little while to cook them. I'd say an hour, maybe an hour and a half. We're going to put them in the oven and we'll be right back. Okay Ty, let's go check and see if our pork chops are all right. Oh, that's good. Whoa, blind. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that looks good. That looks really good. The pork chops. Oh, those potatoes and carrots look very good. Very, very good. I'll have to get the onions in the gravy too. Oh, I wish you guys were here to smell this. It smells so good. It does. It we'll be right back good. to show you the ending results. See you in a minute. Okay, here's your final results. Stuffed pork chops with potatoes and carrots and onions cooked in the oven with the gravy, the mushroom gravy. And of course, you have to have your F shots. So we'll see you next time. <laughs> Ta-da! Ta okay. Hi, Cal. I mean, I'm going to add the... Bread crumbs, stuffing, and a fourth of a, a fourth of a um, <laughs> teaspoon of tablespoon cup. cup. Anyway, right. you do weird things in bed by yourself. I don't. <laughs>